Hi, my name is Bill Heinzman, and you're looking at my Outlook contact page. I thought it would be cool to create an Outlook add-in that would geolocate a contact's business address. Instead of a map or directions, I wanted to provide a relative perspective or sense of where a person worked. You're looking at NASA's WorldWind Geo Platform. Unlike other Geo Platforms, WorldWind, an open source Java SDK, is very planet from space centric. Using .NET Java interoperability, Visual Studio support for Office add-ins, and geocoding services from Microsoft's Virtual Earth, WorldWind will provide a sense of flying into a location from orbit. I have already created an Outlook 2007 add-in project using Visual Studio 2008. In this next step, I'll create a new form region. The form region will be a separate page and associated with a contact. Because we will want to embed a WorldWind widget into the form region, I'll also add a panel control to the form. WorldWind is a Java application, so we need to add a .NET to Java interoperability project using JEnbridge Pro. We'll use a Visual Studio plugin to generate .NET proxies of the Java classes in the WorldWind SDK. To create the .NET proxies, we first need to configure the proxy plugin tool to point to the WorldWind SDK jar files. Using Reflection, the proxy tool will load all exposed classes contained in the jar files. We can look at any class interface. Here it's the Java AWT control for displaying the WorldWind Earth globe. By selecting WorldWind GL Canvas, we choose to expose that class and all dependent classes in a .NET proxy file. When the project is built, the result will be an assembly containing proxies of the chosen Java classes. In order to geocode addresses to latitude and longitude, we add a service reference to MapPoint Web Services. We also reference the .NET proxy file and various WorldWind namespaces. In this method, we create an instance of the AWT widget WorldWind GL Canvas. Next, we call the MapPoint Web Service to convert the address to latitude and longitude and return a WorldWind lat long object. Two methods animate the WorldWind globe. At runtime, .NET proxies execute in the CLR, representing Java objects executing in the JVM. The CLR and JVM run in the Outlook process using a shared memory channel for communication between proxy and Java objects. Let's run the add-in. Remember, you're looking at a Java AWT widget embedded in a Windows form. Using a Visual Studio .NET Java interoperability plugin, NASA's WorldWind Java SDK, and Virtual Earth MapPoint web services, I'm able to fly in from orbit and land at the business address of an Outlook contact.